Good day, teachers. Well, I am just a little bit excited this morning because Google Slides has added a color dropper to the tools, and that makes people like me super excited. A color dropper will let you match colors exactly. And so in this case, um, I matched the colors of these circles, which are drops, to the little birds that are sitting on the wire. And now I'm going to show you how I did it. Here is a slide with a simple image on it, and let's try and match some other colors to it. So let's select um, some the words that are in this text box. We're going to go up to the A where you normally would go to change the text color. Click on the A, and you will notice under the word custom, there is this new little pick a custom color. And this is going to let me hover over and choose a color very tightly directly off of this particular image. I can do the same process with the fill bucket to fill in behind. The only thing you can't really do very easily with a color picker is change the background color on a slide, but I've figured out a way around it pretty easily. When you want to change the background color, um, instead of trying to use the color picker, let me show you what happens when you do that. It's, it's the whole image is darker, so you end up getting a bunch of grays. Instead of doing that, let me say done here. Ooh, that is ugly. Is you just pick the color ahead of time and it'll sit in the custom colors. So I have already picked colors from this particular slide, so I should be able to just select them from this group of colors right here and here's that pink that I picked earlier. And that is the amazing new color picker in Google Slides.